okay let's start with this tutorial we're gonna use strips plus log let's make a pillar uh, seven height then leave three blocks and make another pillar nine height then leave five blocks and make another nine height pillar and then other three blocks and make a seven height pillar from the seventh block let's connect all these pillars together and now let's make the same thing on the other side so first the seven height pillar then leave three blocks and make a nine height pillar then five blocks and make a nine pillar and then three, three blocks and make a seven blocks pillar okay just four five okay, seven and from the seventh block let's connect the pillar together now let's connect uh, these two structures together from the seventh block okay together like this and the same thing on the other side let's connect with spruce log now from the seven height pillar of right um, leave four blocks make another pillar all the way to the top then four blocks make another pillar then another four blocks and make a pillar same thing on the other side leave four blocks make a pillar then another four blocks and make a pillar then another four, four blocks to make another pillar and we are now have uh, this structure which is the base of the barn okay so now let's make the base wall we're gonna use some stone bricks to make a uh, two height uh, walls all the way around like this we're gonna mix some cobblestone some undesired some normal stone okay just like that uh, in this in this middle part let's leave a free wide block um, space sorry um, just I just mix all this type of stone to create some sex texture but it's not that important just use some different type of stone uh, to make it look cooler you can also use some mossy stone mossy cobblestone um, uh, mossy stone brick cracked stone brick okay just to add some texturing but it's not that important at the back part in the middle uh, we can fill all the all the area uh, and like the front part okay so like this I'm just using some random combination Now okay so now uh, the third part we're gonna leave it uh, empty I'm gonna fill the last part okay like this now we can make the front part we're gonna use oak planks, stripped of log, grass block, a composter, spruce sign, spruce trapdoor, dark oak fences, oak stairs, and spruce stairs. Okay, so let's start with stripped log like this, then make uh, two wide blocks 
window with fences and add some normal hook for texturing then block with grass block and cover it with spruce trapdoor in the corner we're gonna use some spruce stairs like these and decorate it with the trapdoor so now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side okay so a window with dark oak fences grass spruce trapdoor and the stairs on the, in the corners with trapdoors and that's it for the middle part we're gonna use hook and I prefer to put everything in the same direction so I'm adding this thing like that now hook stairs and mix with planks for texturing like this of course stairs in the corners trapdoors and we're gonna use trapdoors to make a door a big door okay like this the sign and serve for a hook to place it and look like a door so I look like a door okay now we need the roof so we're gonna search for deep slate uh, deep set slab okay also take some polish deep slate that we're gonna use later okay so from the left part put a block on the seven eight um, pillar and then go left of two blocks uh, on the lower part like this then from these we're gonna make a slab stair uh, nine blocks so one two three four five six seven eight nine and the tent will be the center okay and now from the center let's go down to three four six seven and just two blocks like the other part okay just like that and now let's do the same thing on the other side so two block two blocks on the right part then one a stair one two three four five six seven eight nine ten which is on the, in the center and then go below four five six seven eight nine and ten with two blocks that goes um, like this then connect with two slabs like these the two roof part okay remember to put the slabs on the uh, on the hello part and the same thing on the other side on the lower part sorry now for the um, the second row we're gonna use the polish deep slate and as you can see I place it up a block 
a slab uh, upper than than the normal deep, deep slate cobbles cobble deep slate okay so just a slab upper just like that okay same thing for the other side you can also replace the deep set if it's in, in your way Now we want to count from the deep polish deep plate four no three blocks okay and then had another deep slate uh, on the same level of we did then five blocks and put some deep slate again polish deep slate then another five blocks always a block upper and then we leave three blocks okay so just like that we do the same thing on the other side so first leave three blocks then leave five blocks then another five blocks and three blocks at the end okay Now for uh, finish the front part we want to add the composter uh, like this, in the middle will be a block uh, um, like this, okay, a little bit deeper, okay. Then add a window in the middle cover with polish uh, the roof part which is deeper and use some stairs like this okay so this is the front part fully finished now let's make the back part we're gonna use uh, oak stairs composter dark oak fences plus slabs plus stairs plus trapdoor and remember you can use mossy stones and to mix like that okay okay so start with uh, the composter on the left side just the full wind uh, the full wall and then add uh, a window with dark fences composter on the upper side which is less deeper then add uh, slabs like this <laughs> We can do the same thing on the other side, on the right side, so a wall full of composter, then a window make a, made of spruce, no, dark oak fences. For the, for the center part, use stripped oak log, okay, like this, and for the upper part, just stay with the deeper design okay then add two windows like this and add also some normal oak log uh, uh, oak planks for texturing Then add three slabs like this and two trapdoor like this. Okay, complete the roof. Add the stairs, plus stairs, and two windows. Okay. Also add spruce stairs on the left side and the right side. Decorated with trapdoor like this. 
also in the middle part and of course the right side and now also the back part is completed okay so now it look like that we can continue with the left part so pull all this wall with composter then add um, spruce logs like this on the third um, blocks height okay then uh, for the second part let's uh, use some oak Block, strip of block, mix some normal uh, uh, um, planks, texturing, then take some spruce fences and uh, with these spruce fences we're gonna cover all this wall like this, even the bar below. Okay. Now for the third part that we leave, uh, we're gonna do it um, later. Now the the final, just use logs and take some oak trapdoor. We're gonna make a window of four trapdoor like this. Make some other planks for texturing. like that of course with trapdoor okay the same thing on the first part on the first wall um, stairs with trapdoors in the same way of course we don't need trapdoor for the second part and for the third part we're gonna uh, um, use some stairs like that then below the stairs we're gonna use a spruce log a block a little bit below okay and now in this in this way we're gonna use trap door to make a door all the way up here a little bit below so now I Okay, just like that, just not that high, okay, just like that. And now uh, we're gonna use other trapdoor, uh, just place yourself here and, okay, add trapdoor like this, at the same height as the other one so just like this okay perfect the trap door are five blocks high okay and now let's add some sign and a hook okay spruce sign and a hook uh, put uh, the hook here and there okay and on the all the other trapdoor let's put a uh, uh, sign so on the first row second four and the fifth like this okay so one two three four five okay And you have this beautiful door. Now let's add some logs here on all the pillars and close the, um, the holes that we lived before. 
now uh, we're gonna do the other part okay the right part so first as the other side use the composter for the right side wall then for the second use oak log stripped off log like this same thing for the third and also for the last wall okay just like that now on the last wall uh, had some trapdoor as um, windows and also some normal planks for texturing like this of course this left part is the closest with, um, with the door on the second part let's make um, a hole for adding a door so just like that take uh, oak stairs and put it like that to make a, a little arch okay and now we can decorate it with uh, more texturing now we need uh, stairs put it like that and also some trapdoor and put it like this to make this kind type of decoration the stairs is put on the fourth block okay and then put the trapdoor like that in the same way to make this decoration adds always some texturing now we want to add the door so put three trapdoor okay so one like this and one like that okay a little bit uh, offset like this okay so it seems a little bit open then had the hook just like that very easy add this logs and close the roof as the other part okay now we're gonna continue the roof so we take some polished deep slit slab and we add some slab like that so we now have four slab like this for even on this part and on this part now we want to put this this lab on the on this block in the part below like that even here and there and now on top of this lab we're gonna make a, a new pillar three four five six six hide pillar okay like that even on this part and on this part and now we want to do the same thing on the other side so add the slab okay so two more slab on the other side then add a slab below and then make a pillar six block pillar okay six block pillars Now we want to connect the top part of this pillar with okay every pillar we connect from the top part like that okay and now we have something that looks like that Okay, now we had some log, uh, not on the top part, but on the block below, so like the fifth. And from here, we put two slabs, one on the top, and one a little bit um, before. Okay, and now we do the same thing as before, so three, four, okay. 
to to the the middle part and then below three four five six seven eight so we have eight seven seven plus one on the center we add the same thing on the other side we add slabs like that okay and then we do again the roof so three four five six seven eight which is in the middle part then we go below other seven so two three four five six and seven okay just like that following the slab making a stairs okay just on the the slab um, sorry the the log we put before now that we have this this roof we want to add another uh, row of slabs okay so on the second row we add this, this slab like that which is a block higher of course now we want to take some composter to make all the, the walls the walls of the upper part okay so put like this so a block deeper than the, the pillar okay but before that I wanna make okay so now we wanna make the the lower part of the roof so we're gonna search for green blocks take the most take the uh, concrete powder, green concrete powder, and the green wool. Okay, so we start with placing the deep slit slab like that, a, a, a block higher, okay, to match with the other part, and then we start with um, moss, okay, moss block like that making two part and we can mix in some uh, green uh, powder concrete powder of course uh, the powder will uh, uh, <coughs> will fall so we, you have to put something below or you can use um, the green wool which doesn't fall of course the texturing is up to you so you can mix these blocks whenever you want as you can see it falls but it's not a big problem and now uh, we want to make uh, this part uh, we go a little bit upper a little bit upper so make another two row like this then we can uh, get like this and then upper like this you can remove this composter okay and in the middle part we want to add this deep slate that slab okay we can do the same thing on the other side so every two blocks we go a little bit up of course I'm now not making texturing for simplification like that with the deep slate on top now I'm, I'm mixing some wool because as you can see uh, dust uh, falls <laughs> so if you want to put dust concrete dust you can put some slab below like that and now we want to add a deep slit slab here on the base of the pillar like that pretty easy now we want to do the same thing on the other side so first the 
encapsulate slabs like that then two blocks of moss every level like this side and this side now as you can see I'm not really adding some texturing but if you want to make this look cooler uh, add the nicest variation that you make slab on the base of the pillar okay this is the the lower part of the roof You can also um, change a little bit like this um, the shapes it doesn't have to be straight uh, um, too straight like this it can be a little bit natural okay as you want I prefer to not stick too much to <coughs> straight shape okay now we want to make the walls you're gonna use the, the composter like this so put these a little bit deeper than the pillars uh, cover all the wall with with a uh, composter then take some um, a spruce trapdoor and dark oak fences we can have a free blocks window and then add the stairs on the corner with the trapdoor for decoration and we can make the same things on the other side so just composter everywhere then three high windows made of stairs in the corners and the drop door okay same for the other side so cover everything with a composter then add the windows side and then add stairs and trapdoors okay perfect now from the front part uh, let's make the front part so uh, <clears throat> gonna use the, spru the spruce log in the middle like that okay just to cover uh, the empty zone okay and then add another layer of uh, uh, moss uh, to follow the um, <coughs> roof uh, shape like that Okay, just like that, and maybe add some variation. It's not that important to, that it's straight. I mean, it can be a, a little bit different. Now with composter, you wanna fill all the remain space like that. 
always a little bit deeper than the pillar okay like that and now not on in the on the, on the upper part you want to put um, <clears throat> the composter like that so in the same line as the pillar now take some oak trapdoor and put it like that for making some windows so not on the top composter but the one below just like that okay pretty easy and now with stairs spruce stairs we're gonna make uh, use it in the corners like that to add some decoration also the trapdoor just like that okay pretty easy and the front part is done now uh, let's do the same thing on the back side okay like that with the mouse you can also use some um, I don't know wool things like that not that important okay add the central pillar like that fill with composter like that always uh, a, a, a block deeper than the pillars and then add uh, oak trapdoor for the windows in the two middle spot okay then add composter on the same line of the pillar uh, up here Okay, so now we want to make the the main roof. Okay, so uh, we're gonna use, of course, uh, moss, the moss block, and of course also uh, mix in with uh, concrete powder, green concrete powder, and uh, green wool. So just place a row, two rows of moss block like that. Okay. Then go a little bit upper and place uh, the two other rows of uh, moss and then three rows in the upper part, okay, like that. Of course you can also uh, place uh, the green wool or the concrete powder as you put the moss but I mean just for make it simpler and may I use him all only moss block for now so just make the same thing on the other side like that okay that's it and now you can uh, change the shapes uh, to, for not making that too straight I mean uh, just change a little bit make it that going uh, a, a little bit uh, <clears throat> out or in like that okay to make it a little bit more natural like that okay now we want to use other types of blocks so uh, flowers uh, of course bone meal which is gonna be uh, which is it's much easier to use and some azalea flowers um, I mean you can use whatever natural block you want to use so just uh, take some bone meal and put on the mouse like that if you don't like some uh, part that makes from the bone mill just leave okay just like that I, if I don't like something I can change it okay it feels a little bit natural and now I want to add more azalea some crown flower to add some colors 
different flower with different colors okay very easy but effect effective maybe even some of these flower very cool this plant is awesome Ghibli. more flower can also leave all the carpets because they have different levels so it's a better texturing remember to add uh, the green powder or the green wool okay so texturing is up to you and now we can do the same thing uh, on the lower part I already did it but it's very easy as you can see and you can also use a uh, different type of dirt so coarse dirt, root dirt, uh, the brown concrete powder and the mud to create uh, um, a dirt path all around uh, this uh, barn okay Okay, so now we want to add some fences, so uh, we're going to use Pru's Trapdoor, uh, Dark Oak Fences, and of course uh, Spruce Log. Spru um, so, from the pillar next to the door, we're going to uh, skip the first block and add six fences like that. Okay, then we ha gonna ha we're going to add a, a pillar, three block high. Okay, so then um, <clears throat> just a block, block closer to us uh, like this uh, we're gonna add another pillar uh, skip three blocks where we're gonna put uh, other uh, fences like that and then we're go gonna do the same thing so three fences two block high and then a pillar a block closer to us so as you can see it's not on the same line and now on this block we're gonna add uh, other fences in this way and then another pillar we're gonna do the same thing on the other side so from this pillar we're gonna skip a block and then add the fences like this then a pillar then other fences always free like this and then a pillar then other fences and another pillar then we change the direction one two three one two three we add another pillar okay then we connect these two pillars together with fences and now we cover all the fences with trapdoor just like that As you can see, every uh, fence wall is uh, three blocks like that and two high. And now we need some uh, slab, some spruce slab to put on top of the pillars like that. Perfect. Now, to complete this part, I want to add some uh, stair. Okay, so first let's uh, <coughs> use the, the trapdoor on top of the, of the fences. Then uh, put two slabs like that and change this, this um, slab with stair. Okay, so a stair here and another stair there. Then here we're gonna have two slabs like that. And connect these two slabs with a trapdoor here. Okay. Just like that. And now uh, on 
under this trapter, I want to add the lantern, okay? Just like that. Okay, so this is just a little bit different, so uh, a little better. Then I now wanted to add um, some trapdoor like this, okay, and this, and uh, put some water in for the animals. Okay, pretty easy. And now you want to change all these quartz blocks that I put for <coughs> references and use um, uh, of these blocks, so uh, root dirt, um, coarse dirt, uh, pocket mud, or uh, <coughs> dark concrete, um, brown concrete, okay? Just like that. I also leave some of the the uh, <laughs> the moss or some of the grass um, for a better mixture to leave some grass on the ground and some dirt I mean just make a cool mix okay Take through everything. I also uh, leave the, the grass because I use this area for sheep, so they need some grass. Okay, I'm just showing you how to you can texture this part pretty easy, but I mean it's up to you. Now I want to search some lantern and some chain to add uh, some light to, the, to this build. Okay, so uh, where there is the log, we can add a chain and a lantern, okay, on every pillar, like that, and here, and also here. You can also do the same thing on the other side. You can add some other lantern where you think it's a little bit dark. Okay? So just replace the um, the quartz and maybe add even uh, uh, some texturing on the exterior of the fences. Okay? Pretty easy. Okay, last but not least, I forget to um uh, add some decoration so here we want to have up as the other side these stairs and trap doors like this <coughs> of course on, on every side so here here some other trap door here's some other stairs okay just like that here, here, okay, and like that, and also here, I did it on the other side, but I forget on this side, maybe you forget too, so add trapdoor and stairs like that in the corners, just like that. That's it. Okay. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Leave a like, comment, and let me know if you want the interior tutorial.